What's up everyone? Welcome back to our channel. I am starting off this vlog from where I left it off last week. So if you guys want to go watch our vlog from last week, I'll have it linked down below. Um, we are getting ready to head out for my aunt's birthday party. We have a nice like fun brunch that we're gonna go do. Weather is hot and humid today, which is a first for me at least this year in Montreal. Looks like it might rain later. Right now we have like a mix of sun. We have a mix of sun and clouds, but we do. And uh, it's like all over the place, but the actual weather itself feels hot outside and humid. But I'm wearing a gray sweater, of course. Just have it with some shorts and I'm gonna have my sunglasses. Now I look like a real celeb undercover in JK. We are heading now to my aunt's. Like I said, we got her some coffee as a gift because she's obsessed with coffee. And hopefully we can get some footage there. And then I don't know what we're getting up to the rest of the day. It is technically, is it Victoria Day today? Yes, it is. So it's a holiday here in Canada. We celebrate Victoria Day because technically Canada is still a Commonwealth country. So we are technically under the queen. Although we like have our own prime minister and like our own laws and stuff, but we celebrate the past queens and everything like that because we are not like America that's separated and we do not have an Independence Day. Celebrating Victoria Day, aka just getting together with family for my aunt's birthday. Because <laughs> my aunt was Queen Victoria. Dan was nice enough and got some coffee, some iced coffee with almond milk. So yummy. And uh, I'm gonna go get some brunch food. Hi guys, okay, flash forward. We actually didn't film at all <laughs> at my cousin's house because it was super quick. Uh, we just like had brunch, open oh, presents, and then- It was kind of crowded too. Yeah, it's small and just what like a lot. Oh, like, just, just like what's just, going on yeah. with the family and stuff, but uh, then we actually, not rushed, but we went to pick up Boo, and now we're at Catherine's condo. <laughs> Woo! Alex, the memes? We just recorded the podcast because we wanted to talk about Game of Thrones and stuff. But. The memes that you post on your story are so good. Well, they're just from Reddit. I know, but like, it's funny. Yeah, I know. She's so excited. Like, I love, I love yeah. this one. Do you guys know what the spinoff is supposed to be about? The, the Children, Children of the, of the Forest. Forest. Oh, okay. 100%. Yeah. Yeah, but that's not written by George R. R. Martin. I, I had read an article recently that said there's supposed to be five spinoffs. HBO is like planning for five different so spinoffs. So annoying. The only one I would be really interested in seeing. Arya? No, is okay. Robert's Rebellion. So like the war. Oh, that would be cool. The war right before that started. With the Mad King. Earth, with the Mad King and his son, the Prince. And then yeah, Lyanna Stark. Yeah, like a prequel. Like that would be really cool. Like a mini series, because I don't think they could make like seven series out of that. No, you do like two or three seasons. But like seeing like Ned Stark as a teenager, yeah, living how with, he grew up. Living with teenage Robert Yeah, Baratheon. because I didn't realize this, like I forgot it, or I must have forgot, but Ned Stark was literally like Theon. He was like was a prisoner a yeah. of like the, the family. So he grew up as a brother, but he wasn't actually a brother. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Boo, do you want to snuggle with Catherine? No, nope. boo, why do you always have to do that? Well, just oh, he smells couch. something in your come couch. On, come, down. come. Hey, come on. Go. Good boy. It smells like cat. Yeah, there might still be cats in there. Oh, you're like just a scent. Just a scent, you baby? Yeah. Maybe from your butt sitting on the couch all day. <laughs> all the farts. You like my farts? Eh? <laughs> so, because we have an upcoming trip, I'm trying to get rid of things that are in the fridge. So, one of the best things about leftover lasagna is the next day. Lasagna the next day for some reason is like almost even better than it was the day it was made. Day, two, three days later, it's so freaking good. And then there's some leftover pasta from the other night, leftover asparagus, trying to clean out the fridge so that we can leave it somewhat empty for when we're gone so that things don't like rot and go bad. And then we just throw everything out. And look at how cool that is. There's a nice blue jay right there in the tree. You guys see that? Right as I was talking and I stopped filming before, I saw it fly and land there. Oh, 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 look at that. Look how beautiful he is. It's a little blurry because it's zoomed in, but look how blue. Oh, see ya. Okay guys, it is a brand new day and we are heading to, um, well actually, we're not heading anywhere right this second. Tim's coming, over. Tim's coming over, we're gonna record the podcast and then after that, head out for a Mother's Day brunch. It's actually Saturday today, not Sunday. Mother's Day is technically tomorrow on Sunday. But um, because we have plans tomorrow with my mom and my grandma, Dan's family did something today. 
or is doing something today. So we're doing a family brunch at a restaurant, which I've never been to, so I'm excited about it. And then after that, we are gonna like kind of chill. I have a video to edit. And then we are going to my cousin's house tonight for dinner, who I haven't actually really like filmed before. So she has a daughter. She's so cute. And we're gonna go over there for dinner. I'm not too sure if I'm gonna film that just cause like they're literally never in my videos. So just, you will see. But tomorrow's gonna be a fun day because we have a whole thing planned with my side of the family. So I'm very excited about it. So I'm wearing a thrifted Tommy T with my thrifted jeans, keeping it very casual. Boo's chilling over here. Hi, Bubba. Are you having a good day? Did you have a good walk this morning? Yeah. Our whole video is just consist of how cute you are. I wish you guys could pet him. He's so soft. You're so soft. You're a funny golden. You're a funny golden boy. Look at this. Oh yeah, she's very handsome. I'm in such a good mood because it's sunny outside. The trees are finally blooming. I actually see little leaves peeking through, which just makes me so incredibly happy. I feel like the leaves appear out of nowhere, like overnight. They're just like, poo. Uh, Cause yesterday there was no green. I don't know, it's probably out of focus, but like all the green up there in the distance was not there yesterday. Tim just pulled up, so let me see if I can uh, get him on camera, but who heard him and put his paw up cause he's ready for the snuggle party. Are you ready for the snuggle party with Uncle Tim? He's so like curious right now. Do you hear someone? <gasps> Come in. You did. Look at his Uncle Tim. He heard you coming and he got all excited. He was like, <gasps> Boo, come on. You gonna go snuggle on the couch? Come, Boo. Yeah. Open the couch. He's coming. He's coming. You ready? Go sit. Go sit. Come on. So funny. <laughs> it's like their tradition, sitting on the couch cuddling. <laughs> bring bring up your passions and interests with other people, and I guarantee you're gonna find people that align themselves with you. You know? Um, yeah. But it <laughs> yeah. is hard. It is hard to make friends. Sometimes yeah. you don't, you know, have great connections immediately. Yeah. But yeah. just keep working on it and I'm sure you'll make connections. You got this. Yeah. Yeah. Have faith. Have oh! Oh! <laughs> faith, have faith. Oh, that was, that really was bad. How yeah. many times have people made that joke to you, girl? Yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> A lot. Yeah, exactly. It's funny for us, but she's probably like, oh shit, not again. We are in the car now on our way to the brunch spot. Is it even brunch? Tim said it's just like a lunch spot. It's, I think it's dinner as well, but we're going at kind of a brunch weekend time. Yeah, but it sounds really good from what Tim is explaining, like good lunch food and stuff. I'm excited, I'm so hungry. We got some flowers for Daniel's mom and we got um, a fun little, I guess gag gift for Val, because Dan's sister is also a mom, to three beautiful children, but she is obsessed with Diet Coke, so this is our present to her. Got her a Diet Coke and then a card as well. And also picked up some cards for my parents. My parents, my mom and my grandma, who we're gonna see tomorrow. And yeah, everything's complete except for flowers for tomorrow, but we're gonna buy those in three. Yeah, we'll buy them tomorrow. Food. <laughs> Fries. Oh my god, it fell apart. So, how was the lunch? Terrible. <laughs> food is so bad. I'm definitely not coming back. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna shark. Oh my god, Timothy. It's that bad. <laughs> does, Look. does mommy and daddy have your hat? Yeah, it's at school. It's at school? Did you leave it at school? Yeah. Yeah? Do you see yourself? Look, can you see yourself too? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Guys, that food was so bad. One of the worst restaurants we've ever been to. Yeah. It used to be a different cook and then... Well, supposedly it burned down, so I, I, yeah. guess, I guess a lot of things changed since then. I had never been before, neither has Dan, but I it's very rare that I say food is bad at a restaurant, but the food was so bad. Like I got that salad, it was the lettuce was like soggy and old. Yeah. Not, none of the vegetables were fresh. The fries were not good. Dan said his burger tasted like, he said even Tim's ribs, he tried them and he had to spit it out because it tasted like super old. So knock on wood, none of us get sick, but we're back home now. We're gonna chill here for a little bit before we head off to my cousin's for dinner. We have dinner plans, like I said. I hear somebody. He wants to see mommy. <gasps> Did you have a fun nap when we were away? 
Oh, I think he has he, to go out. He, no, he's fine. <laughs> okay, you guys, some time has passed now. We just hung out at home. Our neighbors are having like a crazy party, so there's such loud music. Happy Mother's Day. <laughs> It's like a bunch of teenagers in the backyard. They have like huge speakers and they're just blasting music. Uh, but yeah, we're heading to my cousin's right now. Like I said, I don't think I'm gonna film just cause it's awkward. Like, I don't know, maybe I'll film with Mackenzie. It's my cousin's daughter. She's so cute. I'm gonna bring you guys along, see what I get up to. But yeah, it's also our first time being invited over to their house, so. He's like my oldest cousin. So him and I were never like super close just because he was like, I think 12 when I was born or something. So we just, I have so many cousins. I just was never like that close with him, but now we're all adults and we get along a lot better. So I'm excited to like actually have a relationship with him, but yeah, I wanna go. Got some flowers. We're taking care of business. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. Taking care of business. Happy Mother's Day, daddy. <laughs> I never for one, for one <laughs> second. Yes, you are. Yes, this Great Dane is 11 years old. He's a big boy. You're just an old man. <laughs> we are back at the house today. Right, Boo? Yes. Right, Boo? Back at the house this morning because we had to drop the car off at the garage. And you had to come with us. You had to come with us, Mooney. He's so cute. I went to the bathroom before and Boo starts coming upstairs following me. Mm. So I'm like, what, Boo, you want to come in the bathroom with me? <laughs> and he's like, I'm like waiting in the bathroom. I'm like, Boo. And then he comes in and the look he gives me, he's a sock in his mouth. He's <laughs> looking at me and I'm like, come here, baby. And then I went pee pee with him beside me. Did you pet him? Yes. He loves to do that. He loves to come in the bathroom. I want that little face. I love that little face. Oh my god, he's so cute. You want to show them how you kiss him? You have to give him kisses. Go. That's gross. Lola literally looks jealous in the background. <laughs> She's like, bitch. He's so What funny. a cutie. Don't you find he looks like a fox? No, he literally looks like a chipmunk. Look how he's sitting. <laughs> What's up guys? So I just finished filming a self-tan video and it's so funny because well I look very overexposed now But when I self-tan this morning like look at my arm I didn't exfoliate properly so I was like great perfect in time for my video But that's okay because I was able to show what happens if you don't exfoliate and your self-tan is gonna look a little weird I'm just excited for the weather to start getting warmer I'm going away next week. Actually, by the time this video goes up, I'll probably already be away. So we are going to New Orleans for Tessa's Bachelorette. I'm so excited. It's been exactly a year since my Bachelorette in Greece. And it's just bringing back all the memories. And I just want her to have like the best time ever. I don't think I'm going to be vlogging it just because this is like her weekend. And I don't want to like throw my camera on her weekend. And you know, maybe she wants to make a really cool, intense video about it. So I'll let her do her thing, but I'm really excited. I hope it goes well. I mean, we're 15 girls all in one house. You never know, there could be drama. I really hope there will not be drama. I spoke to my friend Catherine and we're like, if there is, we're just gonna like stay out of it, make sure Tess just has like the best time of her life. This was my setup. <laughs> There's a boo-boo. And then if we come in here, hello. You can see me. I can see you. What's up? I think I was waiting for you to finish your video. I'm so hungry. Is it noon yet? It's 11.40, so... Oh, 20 minutes. Almost time to make it do it. Guys, I'm still intermittent fasting. You like my leg? Mm-hmm. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm so lucky. Mm, you smell good. Thanks. I didn't even put anything on. I got makeup on your shirt. Look at my arm. The alien arm. Compared to mine. Yeah, yours is normal. No, like the color. Hold me. <laughs> Are we annoying? <laughs> <laughs> I'm literally, literally just wearing a shirt. It's comfortable. So now I have to finish editing a video that my sister and I filmed yesterday to have that up for you guys. I think it'll be up already so if you want to check that out we answered questions that made us uncomfortable there's a few things i have to edit out just because like for legal reasons i don't want to get in trouble with anything so i'm editing that out and then gonna edit the self-tan video to have that go up 
and then I need to schedule what other videos I want to go up while I'm away. I'm also doing something really exciting after Tessa's Bachelorette with Catherine, and I'm gonna film that, so I can't wait for you guys to see it. And then Dan is actually, okay, so this is the plan. We're driving down to New York, because flying out of New York is way cheaper than flying, flying out of Montreal. Dan's gonna stay with Pat for the weekend, have like a little bromance type weekend like they did last year in Greece. And then Catherine and I are gonna fly out of New York to New Orleans for Tess, and after that, we're flying back to New York, and then we have something fun planned, and then we come home. So yeah. So time to eat, and I made a little like mixed board. Some olives, some spicy cheese, ham, salami. Uh, I think that's gouda and cheddar, some crackers. This is some of Mama's delicious, delicious cake. It's so freaking good. And then a little like tomato bocconcini lettuce salad. And then Alex gets the other half of that salad. Mm -hmm. My favorite's Gouda. Hey guys, I look a little rough right now, but I'm editing the vlog because we have a lot of backed up footage. The next few vlogs are gonna be kind of playing catch up because of the trip and everything, and then we're gonna be back to regular scheduling, so the next few vlogs will just be like a few of our weeks. Still really fun content, but um, yeah, we're just playing a little bit of catch up. But I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below, and we'll see you guys all in our next vlog.